Hey there guys, I'm Hello Japan, and welcome back to more Knack. <laughs> so, hopefully uh, you guys can forgive me. I was gone for a little while. I took a little bit of a break from recording. I really needed it, because I've basically been recording non-stop and doing schoolwork and managing life in general. So it, it can get a little hectic, and I wanted a little bit of a break to go home and visit family. Um... Not worry about recording, not worry about anything. But now that I'm back to Knack, hopefully you guys are going to be happy with it. Uh, I'm thinking about finishing the the LP either in this session or I'll do the next two chapters and then have one last session uh, for chapter 13. Because there are 13 chapters. Uh, but yeah, that, that, if that is where, or if you're wondering where I went, I went home for Thanksgiving, I have finals coming up, so I figured I might as well finish up a couple games while I have the chance. So today we're gonna fit, well, today or tomorrow we're gonna fit Knack, and then after that I'm going to finish up Medal of Honor, and then after that I'm gonna finish up Splatterhouse, or maybe I'll finish Splatterhouse first because I'm basically almost done with it. Uh, but anyway, that is trivial and it does not matter so one one more more final thing before we get started i uh, i actually am switching back to my old recording method so if you notice a little bit of an audio desync between this between the episodes you know coming up uh yeah let me know so hopefully it's not that big of a deal but it could be so anyway let's just get started we are on chapter 10 hopefully I know goblins, nope. and I do. A place like this should be crawling with them. Yeah, I just saw one over there. Um, yeah, so there's... We're in chapter 10-1 now. As I said earlier, there are 13 chapters, so we are very, very close to being done with the game. I honestly don't know what I'm going to play after I finish up Splatterhouse, Medal of Honor, and Knack. I have a couple games I'm thinking about. I'll probably put up, after I finish everything, I'll probably put up a poll asking you guys, or at least, not maybe not a poll, but just ask you guys what you think would be, oh shoot, what you think would be a good game to play. Sorry, I'm not playing very well, I'm just trying to get a lot of thoughts off my chest right now. Um, no, but yeah, there's a couple of games I've been thinking about. I, because The Hobbit is coming out this month, I was thinking about doing a, uh, a Hobbit-inspired, maybe not a Hobbit even, but a Lord of the Rings inspired month where I'll play other things, but Lord of the Rings would be like my main thing this month. Because there are quite a few games that I have that are Lord of the Rings games. Uh, like for example, I just picked up uh, Lego Lord of the Rings. I'm actually very, very interested to play that. Because I have not really... You... Gah, I've not really ever played a Lego game before. I have, I have Lego Star Wars... I got free with my Xbox, but it's... You know, I haven't really looked into it that much. God. Uh, well, I mean, I'm not really looking. I've, I've played it a little bit, but, you know, it's... Eh, it's okay. So, yeah, I picked it up on Steam. It was... <laughs> seven bucks. And I was like, hey, you know what? Seven bucks for a Lego game? Seven bucks for a Lord of the Rings game? Heck yeah. Uh, and for anyone who doesn't know, Lord of the Rings is probably, at least uh, Return of the King is probably one of my favorite movies. I just love it to death. I actually just watched it today. <laughs> it was on TV. It was on some random channel and I I couldn't resist. I had to watch it. I love the movie so much. You are annoying. Get out of here. Okay, So we're already getting to a decent size now. Which is awesome. Oh shoot, we have a lot of baddies here. Boom! Backhand! But yes, I'm looking very forward to finishing this game. Come on up, Nack. So I'm very. I, the one thing is, I'm really interested to see who the key is. Careful the key, or breeze. what the key is for that wall. Because I was reading a comment online, someone said it's very dumb and kind of obvious when you find out who the key actually is, or what it actually is. You, you, the whole time you'll been like, seriously? <laughs> seriously, that was the key? Whoa, okay. No, but it's been a little while since I played. I haven't... 
I don't think I've played Knack for like a week now. <laughs> I've, I've made a ton of videos and I recorded a ton and I got them up for you guys as quickly as I could. But it's just, you know, it, it's difficult being a college student recording because you have a lot of other you know, things you need to pay attention to, more so than commentaries and whatnot. Ooh, we got a we got a trading card. Are we gonna get close to finishing something? Ooh, that is a piece that we were, uh, that we need. Oh, the combo meter. We just need one more part. There we go. Like I said, I wanted my little goal, <laughs> little personal goals. I wanted to try and finish one of those parts before the end of the game. Not like like I was saying, I don't have control over what parts I get, but it is still cool, to, you know. Try and finish them up. Oh, you jerk. Ow! There we go. Nice. Whoa! What the heck? <laughs> a log went flying. But no, yeah, so there's, there's, there's a couple other games besides Lord of the Rings games that I have been thinking about. Like I said, I'll either make a poll or there's make a video. And you'll let me know. Well, now what? First time I came here, I free climbed it. <laughs> I figured that's not your style, so I put together a little something to help you out. Calling them fat? Now, these aren't elevators. <laughs> they can't rise until you get off them, so you'll have to do half of the work. Just think of it as climbing a very long staircase. Well, that's kind of cool. Oh, that's actually really cool. Stairs of the future, right there. <laughs> I like the animations for them, though. That's pretty neat. Huh. I like that a lot. Oh, I forgot about those guys. Oh, wait. Are those new? Now, we've seen enemies like that before. I don't know if they're, uh... I don't know if they're the same, but... We've definitely seen enemies like them. Holy crap! I don't think we've seen a big boomerang guy before! Oh, no, 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 we have, we have, we have. We have seen him. I just don't recognize him, uh... Looking so big. <laughs> right, here we go. Excuse me. Don't mind me. Thank you much. Okay. Just had to check. Oh! I fell into the mountain. <laughs> and it is very weird after taking a little bit of a break from LPing to come back and try and get into the swing of things. I mean, it's not difficult or anything. It's not like, oh, I don't know what I'm doing. It's more like... I need to re-familiarize myself with talking to a cam- or talking to a- talking to a web- What the hell am I talking- Talking to a, uh, a, a microphone just, like, no one's here, it's just me. It is a very weird feeling for anyone, uh, who doesn't do commentary, that's how I feel sometimes. I'm like, jeez, I don't spend my time talking to a mic. When, in actuality, I know someone, somewhere along the lines, is going to have listened to what I've said. <laughs> but it is still very- Ugh, God, very weird feeling. Didn't want to fall off again. Very, very strange feeling. A feeling you kind of never get used to. How did... Yeah, I free climbed it. Oh, okay. <laughs> He's such a jerk. Okay, don't touch that stuff. Boop. Yeah, I'm not gonna... Not even gonna. <laughs> Whoa! That was weird. You went a little stiff there. But I'm hoping switching back to this old recording style, I actually... I didn't lower the quality of the video, I actually bumped it down to 720p. But doing so, I actually raised the frame rate of the video. Because my capture software, or my capture device, can only capture uh, 720p at 60 frames or 30 frames, but it only uh, it can also only capture 1080p at 30 frames per second. So, you know, it's one of those trade-offs. You either have really large, nice video, or you have lower video but higher frame rate. So I chose for the end of the series here to go with 720p running at uh, 60 frames per second. So hopefully, hopefully you don't mind. Uh, it doesn't look any worse by any means. Uh, if anything, the video should look a little bit more fluid. 
look a, bit, a little bit more fluid and I guess in turn nicer. <laughs> but even then, it's not really about visual aesthetics, more about fluidity. So, uh, let me know what you think. And if you don't really see a difference, you don't really care. Then <laughs> that's always a that's always an option. <laughs> bah! There we go. Oh, full health. Uh oh. Magnetic resonance? Could be. Whatever it is, something in those rocks is interfering with the platforms. Let's be careful. Yeah, that means uh, Nack, don't don't balls us up. Or you can just skip it. Yeah, that works too. <laughs> nope. There we go. Come on. Uh, <laughs> really? You're not gonna let me up there? There we go. Almost at full sun energy here. Yeah, and I just also saw someone else point out in the comments, you know, there are oh, there are instances where oh, I thought there was some there are instances where I do skip some of the sunstones. And that's simply because I, you don't need to collect every single one. It's not a collectible based thing, it's more of a you either need it or you don't case. Um, like right now, I see this little one, so I'll pick it up. But if I have full sunstone energy, whatever it's called, I, uh, all three circles are full. I won't collect them because it's just not necessary. And I've seen a couple of comments, you know, talk about that, but it's... Again, it's not anything that's too crucial to collect every single one of. Uh-oh. Charlotte! <laughs> You're safe. Yes, I survived their attack. All our hard work was destroyed. That you brought upon yourself. You should never have used my creations against human settlements. They are our oppressors. And when you stopped your work, you hurt us all. With better weapons than these, we could have defeated them. With better weapons, Monteverde would be a smoking hole in the ground. It sounds like you just want my help to exterminate the humans. Charlotte, the humans are our natural enemies. We took you in because you helped us in our struggle. But the truth is, we won't rest until every human is dead. Out of gratitude to you, I won't harm you. But if you refuse to rebuild the weapons factories, you have no place here with us. Doctor, come save me. Please. She's an idiot. 